chicken breast can sometimes be a little boring, but I'm going to jazz it up by wrapping it in some sage and some streaky bacon. And I want to make this a whole meal in one. I'm going to do this in my air fryer. So it not only grills and air fries, but it also steams. So I've given myself a head start and I've already steamed my chap potatoes in the air fryer. And now we're going to build on these flavours and bring this into a whole meal in one. So in a little dish, just like this one, going to add some cherry tomatoes. Look how gorgeous these cherry tomatoes are. I want to leave them on the vine because they look so pretty and it's just going to retain their flavour there. So just a few on the base there. And these are going to blister in the air fryer so they're almost going to make a little tomato sauce to go with our chicken. Also asparagus in spring, they're in season. So we're just going to cut the tops off and we just want to arrange them in this little tray too. A little white wine, so drizzle about a quarter of a cup. To that, some extra virgin olive oil, some pepper. Look at those colours, gorgeous. And we need to season the asparagus and the tomato, so a good pinch of salt. I want to cook this at the same time as the chicken. So I've got this rack and I'm going to place that on top and the chicken's just going to rest here. So two chicken breasts for this recipe and I'll grab two to three pieces of streaky bacon. The bacon has a lovely salty smokiness to it, so it's going to impart so much flavour. So we'll work with one chicken breast at a time. Layer the bacon. We're going to use three pieces. And the fattier the bacon, the better for this because it's going to keep that chicken breast super moist. Also, some sage. Two big leaves of sage in the centre. Just turn that the other way. And then the chicken breast can go on top. We need to season this, so a pinch of salt and some pepper and no oil required because a lot of the fat is going to render out of that bacon and it's going to flavour that chicken, yes, but it's also going to drip down onto those tomatoes and the asparagus, again, giving them more flavour. So wrap that up. And you could put this on that rack straight away as is, but just for extra security, I like to use some toothpicks and just fasten it. So do a bit of a crisscross effect there. One through that way and then on the diagonal the other way. Perfect. And that just sits on top. And the second one, again, three slices of bacon overlapping for this. Now, if you didn't want to use chicken, bacon and fish surprisingly go well together. So if you get a nice piece of cod and place it just like I'm doing here with the chicken, that's a fantastic alternative to chicken. So that goes on top, salt and pepper again. Wrap that up. And then again, the seam goes on the base. Press it together and fasten. Super easy to do. Okay. So that goes into the basket of the air fryer. Place that down. I haven't preheated this because it heats up so fast. So I'm going to place this on the automatic chicken function and I'll set that for 20 minutes. Done. And we'll let the air fryer do all the work. All we need to do is wait for that to finish cooking. All right, it smells good in here. I can smell that bacon and, oh, look at that. Crispy bacon on the top, perfectly cooked chicken, and that only took 15 minutes to cook. Now, naturally, it may take a little longer or a little less, depending on how thick your chicken is. I'm gonna carefully take it out of the basket and pop that here. And to plate this up, we're just gonna simply add some of these steamed potatoes that we did a little earlier. Gonna add three, make this a nice and generous portion. We'll place a chicken breast on the side there. Of course, take out those skewers, it's done its job. And look at these beautiful tomatoes and the asparagus, they look fantastic. Try to keep it on the vine. We'll just place them on top. Some of the asparagus, those spears, Cooked to perfection, nice and tender. A few more. And you can see all these lovely juices in this pan. So much flavour there. The wine, the bacon fat. We'll just drizzle that over the top of the chicken and the potato.
potatoes. And there you have it. Steamed potatoes, crispy bacon wrapped chicken and asparagus. It's a meal in one and it's all done in the air fryer.